listening to 99.9 www. And this is The Talk Show. Hello, this is Thomas Kemp. And Jared Patron. And you are listening to The Talk Show. It is February 15th, 1929, and some big news is one time this day. If you've not already heard, Al Capone's men were apparently disguised as some police uniforms. They lined up the, gang, the North Side gang on the wall of a public garage, and they killed them. They killed them all. Al Capone's popularity has really decreased lately, and he's been named to be the leader of this massacre. He has stated that he was in Florida when the incident occurred, and he states he has no connection to the murders. But we do have Al Capone in the booth right now to talk to you. Al? Hello? Hello, Mr. Capone. So people are saying that your hands are all over this massacre. What do you have to say for yourself? Well, uh, all I got to say is that uh, I was in Florida when all this happened. Uh, my people may have been involved, but uh, I really have no knowledge of this incident. Interesting. But if it wasn't you, then who do you think would do such a thing? I got no idea. I mean, who in their right mind would conjure in such a nonsensical idea to take out a whole group of men? This is an outrage. Thanks for your time, Mr. Capone. Let's just hope that justice is found. And now, a word from our sponsor. Common Man presents Real Man of Genius. Today we salute you, Mr. Prohibition Bootlegged Runner. Mr. Prohibition Bootlegged Runner. Day by day, you supply the nation with the finest alcohol a man can have. Oh, so good. Because of you, America's thirst has been quenched. <sighs> Nobody can stop you from delivering these drinks to the people. We the people. So sit down and grab a cold one, Mr. Prohibition Bootlegged Runner. Because for every delivery you make, America's a better place. Mr. Prohibition Bootlegged Runner. other news, there has been a huge rise in Ku Klux Klan members under the new leader, William J. Simmons, after the publishing of the movie, The Birth of a Nation, which glorified the first group of KKK members. With more and more European Catholic and Jews coming to America, the Klan wanted to support Americanism over white supremacy based on anti-immigrant ideals. Membership has reached an all-time high of 4 million and is continuing to grow. Membership is a fee of $10, which has brought in many new members over the past few years. Right now, the KKK is a very large fraternal organization, with members varying from priests to public officials. The cause is growing, and nobody knows when it will come to an end. Now back to you, Thomas. In weather, it's going to be a pretty cold weekend. Saturday will have a high of 30 degrees and a low of 20 degrees, while Sunday will have a high of 25 degrees and a low of 11 degrees. Expect a partly cloudy Saturday and some snow flurries on Sunday. On Monday, it should warm up a bit as the high is 40 degrees, with the low being 35 degrees. Back to you, Jared. That's all for this week on The Talk Show. Tune in on the 22nd as we talk to the ghost of Teddy Roosevelt and discuss the events that go on in our nation. Have a wonderful evening.